Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Al Bernie News and Views. Did you know that the GDP of the BRICS countries has exceeded the GDP of the G7? This is according to Vladimir Putin. This is what everybody should be focused on right now. Not all of this crap going on in Canada or the United States, because none of this matters. There are no coincidences. All of this is by design. Listen to this. It starts next week in the Russian city of Kazan. It is symbolic that the meeting of leaders in the city of Kazan is preceded by the business forum, your meeting. This emphasizes the importance of close economic partnership between our countries, the promotion of trade and investment, and the deepening of cooperation ties. Joint work in BRICS to accelerate socioeconomic growth and ensure sustainable development brings concrete, tangible results. This actually contributes to improving the well-being and quality of life of ordinary citizens of our countries. The numbers speak for themselves, I am sure, of course, that you know these numbers in general, but I will allow myself to voice some of them. The combined GDP of the BRICS Association is more than $60 trillion. And the total share in the world gross product confidently exceeds the corresponding figure of the so-called G7. And it continues to grow. BRICS is gold-backed digital currency, and they have the framework set up so everybody that joins BRICS can just pay amongst them with ease. That is the goal. You think about all the wars and all the chaos and all the crap going on right now with the United States and Canada and the G7. It is all by design. Just bear with me. What you won't hear in the news, not to mention BRICS gold reserves deposits, leads to a strong possibility to back a currency to a basket of real commodities. However, just as every country was in lockstep, with the pandemic response, so too are they in lockstep with central bank digital currency. This is what you need to understand. So BRICS is 45% of global oil reserves, accounts for 36% of Earth's surface, 45% of global population, half of global food production, 50% wheat production, 55% rice harvested globally. 72% of rare earth metal deposits essential for technology and the green agenda. 31.5% global GDP and rising. Now the G7 has reserve currency status, less than 10% global population, 13.5% global oil reserves, 30% global GDP and falling. This is what everything is all about. BRICS to launch independent payment system based on cryptocurrency and blockchain. There are no coincidences. This is the new premier of New Brunswick in Canada. Listen to this. I mean, I, I spent time in government um, where we were pushing a digital ID project, this notion that every New Brunswicker would have um, a digital identification and way to connect to government services. We took that project sort of as far as we could before it, there was a different thing that they decided they wanted to put money toward, even though I think um, I think we need to fund, we need to make those changes, right? Mm -hmm. and, and I do have a bias, I, I mean, I... The biggest takeaway I think everybody needs to realize People all around the, the world really need to stay focused and ask themselves, who are the bad guys? Who are the bad guys? Think about the life that you want to live and what and how everybody wants to live. And just ask yourself, who are the bad guys? And are they doing what they are doing? Is it good for the future? of humanity humans living on earth is it good for humanity it really is that simple the truth is the absolute truth people can argue and have their differences and have their own truths 
but they will always come to the conclusion of the absolute truth. Now, what is the truth in Canada? What is going on? And who are the good guys and the bad guys? Once you start figuring that out, then everything really starts to make sense. Keep it simple. I will keep you updated with as much as I can when I can. All of you out there, like, share, and take care.